diagnosed with cancer, Edward M. Calvo longed to return to Guam to be in the company of the rest of his family and friends. This disease robbed him of this opportunity. During his battle, he bore pain so excruciating that doctors marveled at how he could suffer silently for so long. His unwavering faith, the comfort of family members, and competent and compassionate care providers and adequate care facilities helped him through his most difficult days. During treatment, cancer patients deserve to be surrounded by friends and family with the comforts of our beautiful island of Guam, our home. The Edward M. Cabell Cancer Foundation strives to provide this opportunity. Board member Jennifer Cabell Kita Guam. My family formed the uh, foundation in 2004, uh, shortly after my grandfather passed away from cancer in California. Um, the, the mission initially was to just provide financial assistance to local cancer patients. Edward M. Calvo was a dedicated family man, phenomenal business executive, and compassionate community leader. The Edward M. Calvo Cancer Foundation is a tribute to his life and memory. Edward M. Calvo Cancer Foundation has given um, close to a million dollars in grants, so we've helped about 1,500 local cancer patients. With that being said, Calvo Kitagua, who is also this year's event chairperson, is pleased to invite everyone to the third annual Guam is Good Wine, Food, and Art Festival, which is slated for Saturday, March 2nd, at the Cars Plus showroom in Mighty from 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. The unique art show that accompanies the wine tasting and pairing includes an eclectic mix of art created by a special panel of guest artists. The first two were actually the, the wine tasting and art show, but um, because of the generous contributions from local restaurants, we actually changed the name to kind of more accurately reflect you know, what this event is. And um, it's a showcase of art created by local celebrities, dignitaries, um, and as well as a few local artists, um, as well as a, um, we provide a, a sampling of a variety of wines, um, as well as a very generous spread of, of food donated by local restaurants and vendors. This year's panel includes the First Lady Christine Cavo, Senators Frank Ogan Jr., Tina Munya Barnes, DPW's Jay Rojas, businesswomen Ramona Jones, Monica Guzman, Yuko Manibusen, and Karen Gale. Also included is Father Eric Forbes, Bank of Guam's Joaquin Cook, Docomo Pacific's John Cavo, Guam Airport Police Chief Bob Camacho, and local artists such as Zarda Puya, Jessica Idello, Nina Peck, Jamil Justice, and more. Yes, even yours truly had the honor of contributing an art piece. This signature event continues to thrive and always brings out the best in the island community, with all proceeds benefiting the foundation. In every aspect, the, the event has grown every year. Um, after the, uh, at the event of the first year, we weren't, you know, too, too sure how it was going to turn out, you know, what, whether people would be comfortable, you know, contributing the art, but um, by the end of the evening of the first event, we had people that were already, you know, volunteering to contribute art for the next year. So, um, every year it has grown, um, the, you know, number of restaurants that have donated food and then also the number of artists as well. I think we started out with about 10 the first year. We had about 18 last year and this year, uh, 23 total. Um, pieces of art have been contributed. Those participating this year were given a blank canvas and could use any material or medium. The only instruction we give um, our artists is just that they, um, I guess, do an artistic representation of um, what, what they, their interpretation of the phrase Guam is good, which is our slogan. So aside from that, um, you know, they're given an 18 by 24 canvas, you know, told that they can use any materials they like and actually, um, you know, people who attend this event um, uh, on Saturday we'll see that the, there's just a really diverse kind of representation or interpretation of what uh, that slogan means to people. According to Calvo Kitagua, the artwork is amazing with some depicting Guam's natural beauty and others historical and religious figures. Guam is Good has been the foundation slogan since 2004. Uh, those were the, some of the last words that my grandfather um, shared with his mother, uh, my great-grandmother, uh, shortly before he passed away. Um, we you know, naturally adopted that as our slogan because it has you know, special sentimental significance for us. But um, you know, since the foundation, I think we're in our ninth year now, um, it's really kind of evolved and, and become a representation of kind of the work that we do and also just the people of Guam kind of contributing uh, you know, money to the foundation, which we then are able to give to local cancer patients. So it you know, has really kind of taken on a life of its own and, and we felt like it was fitting to um, you know, be kind of the theme for this event. One thing different at this Saturday's festival will be the lovely commemorative wine glass. This year um, we actually will be giving, uh, with each ticket, 
um, a commemorative um, glass with the EMC Cancer Foundation logo, which is the blue E. So that um, will be given to um, each attendee when, when they get to the door, and that will be used to, you know, to sample the variety of wines that we have uh, throughout the evening. She says the ambiance will be set with entertainment provided by the extremely talented guitarist David Duenas. Tickets are $100 and can be purchased at the Foundation's office located on the second floor above Cup and Saucer in Hagania, or at Cars Plus in Mighty. Of course, such an event would not have been possible without the contributions of generous sponsors. With this slogan, Guam is good, and um, you know, if people have know a little bit about our foundation, it's just that we really kind of facilitate this grant giving program on, you know, on behalf of, of the people of Guam who contribute. So um, you know, we invite everyone to come out. It's, it's a $100 ticket. Um, and you know all the proceeds raised from that evening from ticket sales as well as um, the uh, proceeds from the auction um, of the art that will be sold all go to, to benefit local cancer patients so it's you know will be a, a, um, a great time you know for a really good cause so we just you know, hope that people come out and support the foundation for this you know which is our signature fundraiser if you would like to know more about the foundation you can call 472-6854 or go online to their website at www.guamasgood.org